What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. So we're out here this evening, we're throwing around a little weightless fluke. And man, these bass are loving it, they're going wild. It's a pretty intense night, there's bass jumping everywhere, freaking launching out of the water for the bait. So it's a good night, but I hope you like this video. Without further ado, let's get fishing. Back out here at the river this evening. Still pretty early in the evening. It's only like four o'clock. But I'm gonna toss around a little baby Z2. It's like a little mini fluke. Threw this around earlier in the year. I had some really good success with it. With the bass chasing minnows, it should work pretty well. Like I said, it is early yet, so it might be a tough bite till evening starts approaching here but we're gonna see what happens I just want to see something massive blow up on it it's something big just blew up right there where I was just fishing what the heck Let's see if we can get them assuming whatever it was chasing minnows No idea where it went. There we go. Oh, it came off. He's running right at me too. These bass are smart. I mean, you hook them, and you just start heading right towards you right after you hook them, so you can't get any pressure on the hook set. Got him. Oh guy, I saw him swirl on it. All right, just popped off. Had him hooked in the side of the cheek and just swiped at it. All right guys, I think I'm gonna give it a little bit, let the sun set, then we're gonna come back out here. So the bite should be a little more active. Maybe the bigger ones will be out roaming around too. So I'll see you guys then. All right, well, as you can see, we're back out here again. Look, there's a little bash right, right there chasing minnows. Oh, and right up there. Looks like it's perfect timing. Like I said, I gave it a little bit, decided to come back out. Let's walk down here and see if we can get one of these busting bass. Like I said, I'm still throwing around a little, I think it's a three inch. I mean, don't quote me on that, it could be two, but it's called a baby Z2. I'll leave links in the description too. There we go, there's one. Followed it in, little guy. Hey, still first one of the night. Again, just a little one, but we'll take them. I feel like we're gonna have a good night with this little fluke here. There we go, that was pretty sweet. Hit the water, I gave it one jerk. He was on it. A little bit bigger, not much. Definitely a step in the right direction now. There we go, number two for the night. I'm just working this thing like a jerk bait too, just like you would a, a hard plastic jerk bait, but just stay subsurface because it's weightless. Sometimes you can get some pretty cool blow ups too with it. Another little one. It's weird, sometimes they eat it on the paws and you can't feel them bite it until you start reeling, especially when they're this little. I don't even want to count him. It's like freaking bait right there. Another one. <laughs> they must just be stacked out there. Ski him in. They're all like the same size too. There we go. Looking like a good night. Just need something, some size. That's 
always, always our goal. I mean, we're catching fish, number one. Number two, get a decent one. Something I think would be pretty cool to try is those tandem flukes. I don't know if you guys ever seen them rigged. You basically have like a swivel up here that goes down to another one and then you have two flukes. That'd be pretty fun with these. Never tried that. Might have to give it a try sometime. Oh, did you guys see? Ah, oh, I missed them. Did you guys see that? That fish came clean out of the water for it. There we go. Oh, I ripped him clean out of the water. Just saw a decent one jump down river. Looks like the river's starting to come alive. Hooked him in the side of the cheek. So a lot of times they just slap at it. There we go. Another dink. There's one. Oh, a little one. Man, where are the bigs at? Sweet. All right, since this seems to be Dink City here, we're gonna go. Got a different spot down here. All right, I was walking back to my truck to go to another spot, and something just blew up right down here. I don't know if I can cast that far or not. We're gonna try it. Got him. Got a little one. Thought the one that jumped was bigger than this. He got the hook good, right up under the chin. There we go. Oh man, right down there, that was a decent one. Dude, this is intense. Like all up and down the river, bass are just corralling minnows. Oh, <laughs> little one ripping clean out of the water. Come here, bud. Oh, man. What are we gonna do? There we go. Sheesh. There we go, another one. I thought that was a big one a bit. I set the hook like it was a big one. He came flying out of the water. I don't know where the other one went though. It was right in this area. Time. Little guy. All right, well, I had that little one hooked. I was trying to get some underwater footage of him, and he popped off, as you can probably see in the video. But if you can't tell, it's the next day. So we got into a bunch of little ones last night. Came back out here tonight again. Still throwing around that little weightless baby Z2, green pumpkin. Yeah, see if we can have a repeat of last night, but hopefully a little bit bigger fish. Got him. Little guy. Figured there had to be one in this area. First one to start the night. I've seen a lot of kayakers out here today. Came out here on lunch break and then the river was full of them. Got a, I think it's a Bass Nation tournament coming up, kayak tournament in this area. So it's been seeing a lot of pressure today. Oh, that was so cool. Too bad I missed them. Dang it. There we go. There's cast right here. Number two for the night. If you definitely want to catch fish, I would highly, highly suggest tossing around, like I said, a little weightless fluke. It's 
especially this time of year. You might not get big fish like you can see, but you're definitely gonna have fun catching fish. There we go. I watched that guy come in for it. That was pretty sweet. And they're all about the same size. Nothing to take selfies with, but at least we're catching fish. Just gotta weed through the little guys. Eventually, you're gonna find a big one.